What's going on guys, it's Jayho bringing you a brand new video and today I'm going to show you guys my challenge of the Elder's Loot from this past week on all three of my characters. So for this week's challenge of the Elders, the modifiers were Airborne as well as Chaff which is no active radar and then the bonus points came from Melee Kills. So another modifier or bonus point modifier that we saw in a previous week. So Melee Kills are definitely a little bit tougher in my opinion just because you have to get up close and personal with all of the enemies. So it definitely changes the way you play the encounter. But overall I don't think it was the toughest week. I still think the toughest week so far was that one week with Trickle and Exposure I believe. So that one was still the toughest in my opinion. But this week was not as bad as that one. So anyways let's get into the loot I got from this week. So starting it off on my first character on my Warlock for my Elder's Weapon, we ended up getting ourselves the Rocket Launcher, the Nightmare, and for my Armor Piece, we ended up getting a pair of boots, and then I also ranked up my House of Judgment, so we opened that up as well, and we got a ship as well as Aegis of the Reef, which is the Pulse Rifle, so... Taking a look at that first, it came in at 330 like usual, and the perks on it were Head Seeker and a full auto. So it also had small bore and reinforced barrel in one of the columns. So uh, not bad, full auto as well as Head Seeker are some solid perks. Um, maybe I'll try it out to see how good it is. And then for the rocket launcher, it came in at 334, and it came with Danger Close and a Cluster Bombs. Not the greatest perks on a rocket launcher. And then for the boots, Came in at 335, so that's pretty good. At least one of them came in at 335. And we saw intellect and strength and stuff like that on the boot, so not bad. And then for the ship, it looks like uh, some of the old House of Wool ships. This one actually looks like a trial ship, in my opinion, because it has the gold and black on it, so pretty cool. Looks like it's from Trials, maybe. Maybe it was supposed to be in year one, and they just didn't get around to putting it in until now. So going into my next character on my Titan for my Elder's Weapon and Armor Rewards. For the weapon, we ended up getting ourselves the Shotgun Her Champion. And for the Armor Piece, we ended up getting some gauntlets on that one. So uh, taking a look at the perks and everything for the Shotgun. Came in at 335, pretty good. And it had Close Endor Personal and Replenish as the main perks. With Injection Mold and Small Board down the middle. So not the greatest perks on the shotgun. The impact on this one is really solid though so if I had range finder or if I had like rifled barrel down the middle that would have been a decent shotgun. And then for the armor we got a 334 defense armor with scout rifle loader, uh, increased grenade throw distance and discipline and strength on it. Not the greatest for a titan in my opinion so at least one of them came in at 335 that's always a positive. And then finally for my last character of the week on my hunter we ended up getting ourselves for the elders weapon we got a lift no bleeds which is the scout rifle and then for my armor piece we got some gauntlets once again for my hunter and then I ranked up house of judgment once again on this character and for that we got just a cloak so not really the greatest on that house of judgment rank up drop uh, I prefer getting a weapon I'm pretty sure everyone would prefer a weapon over that. Um, but for the challenge of the Elders Rewards for the Scout Rifle came in at 335 with Exhumed and Underdog High Caliber Rounds Brace Frame and Small Bore as the perks. So uh, not really the greatest perks. I think I got a better drop on a previous week for that Scout Rifle. And then uh, for the Gauntlets came in at 335 as well with Intellect and Strength and Increased Grenade Throw Distance and uh, Hand Cannon Reloader. So pretty solid on that one. So at least they came in at 335 though, but that's about it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe, stay tuned for more videos, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!